Demetrius Johnson, the one flyweight champion, should fight not Reese McLaren, not Yuya Wakamatsu, and not Danny Kingad. Instead, he should fight this guy, Kairat Akhmatov, and here is why. If you don't know Kairat Akhmatov, he's been fighting in one since 2015. In his debut fight, he beat Adriana Marias. He's also a former one flyweight champion. Kairat Akhmatov has a 27-2 professional fight record and is a former one flyweight champion. So here are five reasons why I think Demetrius Johnson should take a fight against Kairat Akhmatov. Number one, both fighters actually want this fight. After DJ beat Adriana Marias for the second time in their trilogy, Kairat Akhmatov came into the ring and they had a stare down. At the press conference after that, DJ said this. Kyrie Akhmatov's on a six fight win streak. I love when we go on win streaks. I love taking away from them. Kyrie's an amazing athlete, very, very strong. He's, he's a good wrestler. When I fight him, I'm excited for a new challenge because he brings something different to the table. Which leads me to my second point, Kyrie's winning streak. The man's won six matches in a row, including victories against Reese McLaren and Danny Kinghead, all of whom are ranked fighters in the flyweight division. Reason number three, both fighters are getting old. DJ is 38 and Akhmatov is 36. Both of them are getting towards the ending stages of their careers and this would be a perfect opportunity for DJ to beat a very good fighter and for Kairat Akhmatov to fight one of the best in his career. Number four, DJ needs a challenger. There's been talk about Jared Brooks moving up a weight class, but Kairat is at that flyweight weight class. He can fight Demetrius Johnson. This would be an incredible matchup, especially since DJ has beat most of the fighters who are ranked beneath him in that division. Kairat, on, like I said, on that six fight win streak, probably should be ranked and fight Demetrius Johnson for a title shot. Number five, this would be a perfect fight for one to host in America, especially on the desperately lacking 1-169 Atlanta card. I think Kairat Akhmatov would be welcomed by the American fans, and of course, Demetrius Johnson already has a huge following in America. This would be a perfect fight for them to host in the USA. So those were five reasons why this fight should happen. I hope it does, but here's one reason why it may not. After his fight with Reese McLaren, Kairat Akhmatov did an out-of-competition drug test. So he was outside the window of drug testing and failed it. He tested positive for a banned substance in one. I believe he received a six-month suspension, though that six months has been over since that fight was back in 2023. That being said, if he did receive a six-month suspension, that six months is long gone. I think this fight needs to happen. So what do you guys think? Should Demetrius Johnson and Kairat Akhmatov have this fight? Should it be in America? Who else would you want to see DJ fight and defend his title against? Let me know in the comments down below and subscribe for more content like this. See you next time.